Now, if you're like me and you're a seasoned naturalista or you are transitioning and just starting out on your natural hair journey, the right approach will have you embracing your natural waves, curls or coils in no time. In the loft, all the way from Atlanta, Georgia, we have world-renowned certified trichologist Crystal Styles, Assistant Marketing Director of Aunt Jackie's, to share all of her do's and don'ts for women embarking on their natural hair journey. Welcome to the loft, Crystal. It's lovely to have you with us. I'm so excited to be here. Yeah, really. it's great to have you here. Now, you were here for the Clicks Curls event. Yes, I was. Absolutely. Awesome event. It was so amazing. So you're here to answer some of our questions, and the viewers have sent us some of their questions. There really is no magical way to transition your hair. It takes patience, time, love, and care to find the products that work for you. But the results are well worth it. So we asked some of our viewers what their natural hair questions are, and Crystal is on hand to provide some expert advice. Our very first question is from Kulu Pearl Bertha, who's asking, my hair has a lot of dandruff that seems not to go away, and it also falls out a lot. Is there something that I can use to make my hair grow faster, how can I keep my hair healthy? Great question, Bonnie. Actually, we're gonna um, use our model here. Now, we're not saying she has dandruff or that her hair is falling <laughs> out, but type four hair generally is drier hair. Yeah. The scalp is generally drier. So you wanna look for products that, um, like flaxseed products. Um, right. Jackie's Curls and Coils at Clicks sells okay. a product that has flaxseed in it. Mm -hmm. Well, flaxseed is an omega-3, it has omega-3 fatty acids. Okay. Um, it's good for hair elasticity, stretchability, and it's awesome for dandruff, eczema, dry scalp. So you wanna look for products that have ingredients that are good for dry scalp. You also wanna drink more water. Mm -hmm. As a trichologist, mm -hmm. I have to tell people that, that you wanna make sure that your diet has plenty of water because water is hydrating for your yeah. hair. Water does wonders for my hair. Absolutely, yeah. and yeah. people have no idea how important that really yeah. is. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, right. And our next question is from Numfundo Zim Singwa. She says, my hair is so hard to manage. If I don't wash and plait my hair at night, I couldn't just comb it in the morning. Mm -hmm. How can I keep my hair soft and easy to manage? Yeah, well, first I want her to make sure that she's embracing her hair texture. So here we have, with our beautiful model here, she's type 3 here. Her hair is typically going to be softer right and it's not going to be as dry and she can put her hair up in like a little scrunchie or something shake it out in the morning yeah but type four needs actual yeah. preparation at night so it sounds like the viewer has type four type hair four. so let's type four hair is like mine it's absolutely hardcore work <laughs> a lot of work goes into it so let's embrace our texture yes make sure that we're doing great styling in the evening um, whether it's twists with a nice curl pudding or a gel make sure you're using a nice satin scarf right, on the hair right. because that helps with moisture retention so mm -hmm. it's not as dry in the morning okay. um, and if you don't want to bind the hair with satin scarves you can use satin pillowcases right to keep um, moisture retention yeah. in, in natural yeah. hair because type 4s are going to absorb more moisture than any other texture. Right. So you can mm -hmm. use a slip, a, a yes. pillow cover, yes. a satin absolutely. one. Yes, absolutely. Satins and silk yeah. covers are yeah. very good. Because sometimes a this can be a passion killer. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> of course. So you want to put this on really, really late at night. Really late exactly, at night. Exactly, <laughs> exactly. Our next question is from Busisi Wejiane. She says, how do I keep my hairline from thinning? Mm. I think every woman in South Africa wants an answer to that question. Yes, my travels in South Africa just people watching, okay? Yeah. And I've noticed um, thin edges on many women, and that comes from tight braiding or tight weaving, um, and so you can cause traction alopecia to happen. Mm. So we want to make sure that we catch that in time, and you can also use um, great essential oils and carrier oils like um, coconut, avocado, mango. Look for these types of ingredients in your products that you purchase and do some scalp massages, yes. okay? Because yeah. the hair follicles need good blood flow in order to grow good, strong, healthy hair. Absolutely. Yes. And now what curl type is that? She's type three as well. Okay. So these two ladies are curl I'll type threes. Cool. Yeah. She's more on, well, each number has a letter. So she's on the top end, A, B, is that? Yeah. <laughs> and this young lady here is more 3C, I would say. Okay. 3C, yeah. 4A. Yeah. Yeah. So how can you tell the difference? Her curl type is a little bolder, right? Her curl pattern is a yeah. little bigger, and hers is a little 
tighter. Okay. So as you go down the chart, the hair it gets, gets tighter and tighter. It gets tighter yeah. and drier. Tighter and drier. <laughs> yes. Wow, there is such a wealth of information know, out there. Thank you so much for You're sharing so this with us. All it is about is just loving your hair and embracing it. I love my 4C hair. Now we're giving three lucky viewers the chance to each win a Clicks Natural Hair Hamper to the value of a thousand rand to help you unleash the beauty of your natural tresses. All you have to do is SMS the keyword Clicks to 33650. Vast rates apply, T's and C's apply. Visit afternoonexpress.co.za to find them. Clicks. Feel good. Pay less.